such a tragic day out here at the beach and you can see behind me the waves really crashing in here and that's why today there was a red flag flying earlier because of these rough conditions. Now we have learned from the Martin County Sheriff's Office that two swimmers died after being pulled out of the water. They were caught in a rip current. This happened around 1:30 this afternoon just south of Stewart Beach. They were staying at a private timeshare and were on on the beach in that area. The sheriff's office has identified the couple as 51 year old Brian Warder and 48 year old Erica Wishart. They were visiting here from Pennsylvania, visiting family and on vacation with their six children. They each had three children that were with them today. And we spoke with the Martin County Sheriff's Office chief deputy who says that their children were the ones calling 911. Uh, one of the children of the deceased was trying to yell them instructions of how to swim parallel to the shore, don't fight, but they were in panic mode and unfortunately went under. A lot of people are locals, they understand riptides, they know what to do and what not to do, they know where to get in the ocean and where not to. So uh, we get these vacationers that come in and unfortunately this ends poorly for them and there's no way to get the message out to all of them. And you can see the sign says leaving guarded beach. The family was actually in the water a couple hundred yards beyond the sign. So they were that far away from the lifeguards and the red flags that were flying today. Now Martin County Fire Rescue says if you do ever find yourself caught in a rip current, don't try to fight it. Swim parallel to the shore to try to get out. Reporting at Stewart Beach, Stephanie Suskind, WPTV News Channel 5.